It looks sick. Baby, that's the money spot. You guys are literally being caught by catch them all right now. Bomb, that's it. That's so sick. I don't care what you say. Those are teeth marks. So guys, before I even get started, I want to shout out my new channel called Catch Em All Kingdom. I just posted a deformity of a fish. I'm going to post a lot of stuff that doesn't make it to Catch Em All Fishing YouTube channel. And I'm also going to post all of my live streams on this channel. So when I'm going to go fishing live, I'm going to turn on this channel. And on my other cell phone, I'm going to go live. So all of you guys will be able to see me do stuff live. It's going to be sick. It's live feedings, live conversations, talk like that. But Catch Em All Kingdom, guys. So guys, subscribe to my new channel, Catch Em All Kingdom. I appreciate it greatly, and let's catch them all. Let's catch them all with Catch Em All Fishing with Zach Ketchum. What's up, guys? It's a beautiful night. It's a beautiful day. I got something in the mail, and it made me say yay. No, it's not that crappy bag or this crappy broken thing that the iguanas messed up, and now I got to throw it away because, uh... The hurricane's coming. Yeah, the hurricane's coming, guys. There's a hurricane coming. I don't know. It's like 50-50. Usually the Gulf Stream pushes them away, but uh, it's, it's not really looking too good. Look at the Oscar. Hey, Oscar looking cool. Look at the spider web. They just make them overnight. So um, let's feed our fish a little bit. Oh, God. There you go. Some for you. Just some for the floor, obviously. Got to feed the floor. What's up, guys? You want to eat the rest of this? Get nice and fat. Uh, it's actually a really bad idea to feed your fish before uh, a storm because you don't want debris in your pond You don't want debris in your fish tanks any of that guys just so you know um, that's a tip clean your tanks really well before the hurricane hits um, Don't feed your fish so much because you don't want them pooping and you don't want them doing any of the, or, or making more more of a mess in your pond any any like debris any leaves any like uh plant life any excess food any of that is really bad for your pond or fish tank so while this hurricane's coming i'm gonna get this uh video uploaded before this hurricane and make sure that we're good to go so anyway let me show you guys my trap 100 pound test obviously going on the trap that's kind of cool oh you guys you know it sat there like that that's cool anyway so here's my trap here's my fish here's my trap I'm not gonna do much editing on this video today. I'm just gonna see like if we just go right through it. Okay, this trap was in here, I just slid it out. I wanted to show that, but, but I didn't because I'm, I'm stupid. But anyway, okay, here's a trap. It's like an umbrella trap. It's really cool. Um, I'm gonna see how it opens up. Really cool, it looks sick. Looks sick. Okay, I think you need two hands for this, but I'm just gonna flip it upside down and do it with one because I'm recording. <laughs> All right, so there's a, looks like there's a string in here. Okay, the string comes right out, out of the top. And you just pull it like that. Pretty sick. Whoever made this is a genius. Let me, let me just say that right off the bat. Okay, I'm not, I don't want to do one-handed bandit right now. Um, let's just do it with our feet, okay? So, feet. This, I'm sure this goes through. I'm sure that's what happens. Oh! Oh wow, that is interesting, man. So look at that, it's literally just like an umbrella. And it has a one, two, three, four, five, six holes, guys. And the fish can easily come in here. Let's let's pretend that this camera's a fish. Let's go. We're swimming inside. And now, oh my god, you're stuck in the trap. You guys are fish. You guys are literally being caught by catch them all right now. Okay, so, and there's no way for you to get out. You're gonna get stuck in the trap. You're stuck. You're stuck in the trap, guys. You can't figure out how to get out. But you can actually get out if you just swim. Ah, oh god. You can actually get out if you swim through the hole this way. But, um, but that'd be a pretty difficult thing for you to do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this trap and I'm gonna throw it in the nearby place just to see how this trap does compared to the other traps that I've made. This looks absolutely genius. Um, not saying that the ones that I've made are completely terrible. They're completely terrible. Yeah, I mean, they've worked. Especially the Coke bottle one that was like really fast. That one worked really, really well. So hopefully this catches some fish that uh, 
we've never caught before. This just looks cool for a thumbnail, maybe. Maybe thumbnail. Thumbnail? Yeah? Thumbnail? You guys want to be a part of the thumbnail? Oh my god, you guys look so cool in the thumbnail. Oh yeah, okay, that's going to be sick. Alright, cool. So anyway, um, I'm going to continue to feed my fish. I'm going to tie this, this 100 pound test to the top of it, and then I'm going to secure that in a place that uh, can't can't be uh, stolen. Well guys, we're here. There's my uh, bait trap. There's my bucket for observing the fish and sacrificing them to the mushroom. And the bread. Of course you need the bread. Buttermilk biscuit bread. <laughs> oh yeah, the good stuff. Um, we're gonna go get this stuff on the road. Let's see. Ah, it's a nice day today. It's a nice day. It's a little hot. I have my sweatpants because I'm doing laundry and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm really, I hate laundry, I'm lazy about it. But anyway, let's get our travel, let's go to the other side. Hang in, hang in there, 100 pound cord. Okay, where am I going? Everybody's already looking at me like, what the hell are you doing, kid? All right, so, it's getting longer. What I'm gonna do is set this up, and I'm gonna try to like tuck it away, and um, and I'm gonna go like do all the hurricane shopping and stuff today with you guys. If you guys wanna come, you guys wanna come? Oh, yeah, cool, so I guess you're coming. <laughs> all right, so I got two big things of bread and there is a little zipper actually that you don't really need to use, but I guess that's to harvest the fish. Um, but right now I can just shove my whole hand in there. And I have pieces that I'm just gonna squish up and leave in there. But look, you can literally just have it tucked away in there for the most part. <laughs> it's cool, right? So that's tucked away at the bottom. And then this stuff is going to be in there. Let me grab it a little bit more so they don't just chew it and then run away with it. The Mulva Media. Okay, and one big old, big old squished up piece. Um, and let's just leave that in there. That's that's plenty, I think. Um, yeah, it looks pretty good. I mean, it's really interesting trap, to be honest. Um, this looks nasty and murky and muddy, but I really don't care. There's a lot of little fish. I want it to be flat, so I think what I'm going to do is drop it in the deeper part of this area. Tch, jump around. Jump, jump. Okay. Um, yeah, I think that's the that's the plan. These videos are gonna be so much more fun when I'm not doing them by myself. Bonnie would be out here with me, guys, but uh, she's not feeling well today. Okay, don't die. Don't die. <laughs> okay, right on the edge. I'm on the edge, okay. Right there, baby. That's the money spot. Sink, my friends. Sink. Please don't flow away. Where are you going? You look like, you look like you're floating away. All right, so it's kind of floating away over there. So what I'm gonna do is toss it over here in this corner where I wanted to toss it anyway. Oh yeah, ah, just like floated. Look at that thing, it's so far. Okay, that's actually perfect. And since that bread is sitting in the middle like we had it, um, it, it looks like it's sitting perfectly on the bottom. Dude, so far, so sick, and I didn't fall in. <laughs> All right. So the trap's down and it's time to go shopping. We're gonna come back in maybe 15 minutes to check the trap. I'm really excited. I've been wanting to catch these jewel cichlids for a long time. So I'm hoping that this trap can do it because my other traps didn't really work out except for the, uh, the Coke bottle trap and the dollar store fishing challenge trap. That trap was the best one actually. It produced two of them. So we're gonna get out of here and see what happens. <laughs> All right, guys, so we got a bunch of gas cans, generator, big old thing of water. I like, I didn't get that for the water. I got it for the container that I, I would be able to put water into. Um, a, a good way to store water that a lot of people don't think about is one, filling up your tub, guys. You can fill up your tub completely with water, plug the drain, and you'll have that water. Two, what people really don't think about is your washing machine. You can fill that up and you can drink it. Just shut it off. So do that. Those are two tips. Take them home. They will save you 
100%. So let's go check out our trap. We got all our supplies and we're looking pretty good. I'm gonna get some more water and uh, let's see if we caught any fish. So guys, we're back. Get your bucket. Open the door with your camera hand. Yeah. Get out the car and see what we got. I'm so excited. I just covered that fence. I said it was a fence when it's a bush. All right. Oh my gosh, there's so much going on. Look at all those bubbles. I hope that's... Oh my god, this could mean drugs. No, this could mean turtles though, for real. Okay, so, first things first. These are cichlids. Normally, I would fill up my bucket first um, to make sure that these, whatever we caught, has stuff in it. But look, there's a lot, there's a lot of stuff going on. Okay. Let's do it. Grabbing it. Grabbing it in, baby. Come on, big fish. Dude, what did we catch? What did we catch? We caught something. We caught something. We only caught one. Well, we, we got it, we caught it. We caught it. We caught the jewel. We caught, guys. Guys, you don't know how long I've been trying to catch this fish from my pond. Like not long at all, actually. This is actually probably the first time I've really tried it. But I've been trying to do it with a trap and not with like my, a fishing hook, which says a lot. Oh my God. So guys, this trap definitely works. Let me clean them off a little bit. Relax, 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 relax. This is so sick. Oh man. So guys, as you can see, we would probably catch a lot more, but judging by all the bubbles that are going on down there, I think there's a ton of turtles that are attacking my trap. So um, I'm gonna use this as, uh, let me go get it as Shamu sacrifice. I'm gonna throw it right in this bucket. What did you catch? Huh? What did you catch? I caught uh, some fish uh, that I'm gonna feed my bigger fish at home. <laughs> ah. So, oh. So guys, yeah. Uh, that's the fish trap, it's, it's really cool. Really darn freaking stinking cool. And Here's the fish that we caught with it. Pretty sick, right? Pretty freaking sick, if you do say so myself. I'm trying to, I'm really just looking for a, um, a cool thumbnail at the moment. But uh, yeah, I guess that's it. <laughs> Let's go home and feed Shamu. A new little snack. Oh. So guys, I also wanted to show you how this trap gets uh, taken down. So it has this little clip, which is really sick. Bam, that's it. That's so sick, oh my gosh. And it's just so transportable, it, it's crazy. So this is actually the most insane, awesome fish trap I own right now. I'm definitely gonna use it for like pin fish and stuff. And just having fun, you know? I really love these fish trap episodes because it's more like what I like to do. Like I love fishing, don't get me wrong, I love it, I love it, I love it. But I just really wanna see what's down there more than anything, and I wanna explore. And having the pole in your hand, it just, it just helps you get down there when you can't really hold your breath and swim down there inside like a mucky puddle in the middle of a freaking intersection. <laughs> so uh, let's go feed Shamu. How you feeling Mr. Portable Trap, you're good? All right, it's really hot. Probably shouldn't be complaining since I have my, my sweatpants on. That's It's pretty stupid, but anyway, yay. Baby. Hold on, hold on. One second, baby. You can talk if you want, but. I'm just gonna tell you wearing shirt. I'm wearing your shirt? Thanks, thanks baby. <laughs> okay. Sacrifices must be made. This is a really cool fish, guys. I think we're gonna go after them one day, like strictly after these cichlids, when Shamu isn't really, really hungry. Shamu, Shamu, come here, come here, come here. Come here, good girl, come here. All right, Shamu, I know you're hungry. Give me just one momento, and I will go in slow-mo. I know you wanna jump, girl, you know it. Goodbye, my friend. Nice meeting you, and I will see you on the other side. Here you go. Get it. All right, Shemu, you completely missed. And guys, Shemu have, has teeth, man. I don't know what kind of bass has teeth. Like, Shemu, Shemu has teeth. I don't care what you say. Those are teeth marks. I'm bleeding, my hands are bleeding. That's bass teeth, bass have teeth. I don't care, Shamu, we're gonna give this another try. 
Please aim, aim better, you're not blind. Okay, round two, guys. All right, round two, I'm soaked, I'm bleeding. Please, please, be a good girl. Come on. Yeah, there you go, there you go. Again, 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 Alicia ate it. Shamu, I hope I hope you enjoyed a little snack. We're gonna feed you now with all the dead fish, guys. I, I'm bleeding. I'm like really bleeding. That that's gonna need some neosporin. Oh my gosh, hey guys! I hope you enjoyed this episode. That trap is super sick, super sick. We're gonna catch a lot of fish on that trap. I have a really good feeling about it. But we're gonna target those uh, little jewel cichlids. I think we're gonna fill up the bottom pond with them because they would look so so cool. Look at the Oscar. I've, I've been talking to the Oscar. Come here. Come here. Hey. Look at the Oscar. He comes to me now. Come here. Come here. <laughs> oh, this is my man's Oscar from that last video. Amazing guy. Amazing fish. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Stay tuned for the next one. You know it's coming in, it's coming in hot. We're catching big fish. The mullet run is on its way. Stay safe with this hurricane coming, guys. Take the tips that I taught you today and use them and Catch them all. Catch them all. Freaking Shamu, man. Catch them all. Catch them all fishing. YouTube and Instagram. You like this song, right? Like and comment.